Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to retarget any of the Mizamo motions on any 3D avatar in Blender 3.6 just by using the Rococo plugin add ons. And the Rococo plugin add ons is a free plugin, a free add on for Blender. You can just scroll down, go to my video descriptions, and get the Rococo plugins and install it in. In your Blender 3.6 plugins, the add-ons folder. And if you don't know how to install the Rococo plugin add-ons, I already give you the tutorial link in in the descriptions, the documentation to show you how to install the Rococo add-on. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step how to retarget the Mizamo motion on 3D avatar in Blender 3.6. So first, I'm going to open my Blender 3.6. And while waiting it, I'm going to the Mizamo website as well. Mizamo.com If this is your first time to enter the Mizamo.com, you have to log in. Log in by using your Gmail account. Continue with your Google. It is automatically log in just by using the Google. If you already log in your Google. right and just wait for a while at the same time my blender 3.6 already opens I press a to delete everything and then I'm going to show you how to retarget the Mizamo motions into the blender 3.6 3d avatar so now I, I still don't have any of the 3d avatar as demo I'm going to import an FBX from my desktop the name is model 02 so now you can see once I already imported the 3D avatar into the Blender 3.6, then I turn on the texture and you can see here the name is Armature. This is a bad name, do not use the Armature name. Just because of you exported the animation later, it is going to occur some problems. So the Armature, you have to make sure you press F2 to name it properly, like Model 02. Do not use the Armature as the name for this. All right. Now, once you already imported the Model 02, next, in the Mizamo, here I'm going to find some motion. For example, dancing. I search it from here. Then, this is the Zest dancing. I click it. Now you can see this is the dancing. If you take here, it is mirror. It is going to flip the whole animations. If you feel satisfied already, just click download. Then, here, click download. You can see all of my setup, the FBX binary. The frames per second is 30 with the skin. It's up to you. You better to just, just import and export with skin so that you can see later. Just download it. Right, right now it is downloading. It will be inside my download folder. So once finished downloaded already, I'm going to click the folder, open that folder. It is set here. Now you can see the zest dancing. As demo, I'm going to cut and paste this to my desktop. Control X to cut it, put it on my desktop. Now it is an FBX file. And once done this, I just close the Mizamo. And then from the blender, I'm going to just, just import, import the animations import the FBX that I put it on my desktop just now. The Zest Dancing. And at this moment, I try to play. Yes, I try to play and have a view. Just a few frames. At the same time, I'm going to move this. I press G along the X axis and move it to here. And I'm going to retarget this to here. But before that, we are going to have some setup you can, you can see I already installed the Rococo plugin. I press N. The Rococo plugin is already here. So if you want to install this add-on, you can just go to my video descri descriptions. I already put a, a link there to show you a documentation on how to install the Rococo plugins. If you have the problem, just install it first. And 
Now, my Rococo plugin is ready. I'm going to retarget it. But before that, I'm going to show off the skeleton. For example, this, I click the amateur, the skeleton. I click it. All right, now you can see the name is amateur. I'm going to rename it as well. This one is Mizamo Jazz Dance. All right, now. So now I click the skeleton. I click here and go to the viewport display. I show off. I show it in front and I show the names like that. Then later when you want to retarget it, you can just check the name again. This is very important. You have to do the same on your 3D avatar as well. Now you click here. This location is X because of just now I move it along the X location. Later you have to click here as zero to just make sure you put it back. Now I'm, I'm going to move it here. I press G and press X, it is going to move along the X axis just because of I want to see the reference. So now I click the skeleton, then I go to the viewport display. I'm going to show it in front and show all of the names so that now I, I can just retarget it. I press G and press X to make it nearer so that later I can just compare with it. So now it's the time to retarget the animations from the Mizamo to my model 02. I already opened the Rococo plugin. The first step, what we're going to do is just expand the retargeting. The source, we choose the Mizamo Zest Dance. And then the target, we choose the model 02. Then click Build Bone List. So here you need to expand it more so that you can read this. So now just look at the name, the Mizamo hips is set here. You have to retarget it to these bones, the hips, this one already correct. And some of sometimes the Rococo plugin will automatically detect your bones, so it, it is already filled up for you, but some are still empty, so you need to do it manually. You have to always double check it to make sure it is correct. The next one is the Mizamo rig spine is here. Then it is corresponding to this spine bone yes correct already next what about the, the spine 2 sorry the spine next is the spine 1 should be corresponding to the chest then the spine 2 is not the chest so now the spine 1 should be the chest then spine 2 this is an extra bone and the spine 2 is here but you look at your own model it doesn't have another extra one. So you can just ignore this. The spine two, it is corresponding with nothing. So you have to just, just take it, make sure you remove it. Then the neck, the Mizamo neck, it is corresponding to your avatar's neck. Check, check it properly. And then the right shoulder, the right shoulder is at here right shoulder sorry here so it is corresponding to this the, the right shoulder right the right arm arm so from here you just need to make sure you compare it one by one make sure everything is correct compare your Mizamos skeletons with your 3d model skeleton make sure you fill in the correct corresponding bone bones just one by one until the end everything fill in. Once you already make sure there's no problem, then you have to make sure this skeleton's back to the origin. The origin is that here. The location, just make sure you fill in X, uh, you fill in 0 and press enter to make sure it back to the origin. Then scroll down, click the retarget animations. Click it. Then just within a few seconds, it will automatically fill in. So now what I'm going to do is just hide everything from the Mizamo Just Dance. I hide everything, that just don't want to see this. And then for your 3D model, at this time, just go back to the viewport display and untick names, untick in front. And now we have a check, just try to play this animation. You can see the, the Mizamo animation already fully retargeted on this model 02, your own avatar. And at this moment, once finished retargeted already, you can just press N to just hide the Mizamo plugin. 
then always remember just delete this click and delete everything the Mizamo just done just delete everything we just left this and then save as a blender project file click file save as and as demo I'm going to save it on my desktop and save this as the model 02 with dance now this is just a blend file and I'm going to export as FBX as well click file export FBX then the path mode I will choose copy to make sure all of the texture embedded inside the exported FBX and then scroll down here check the armature and tick the add leaf bones and export the FBX and it is automatically exported on the desktop and this FBX is very useful it already embedded off the material texture and also the animation retargeted just now if I try to double click and open by using a 3D view well, just have a look to see whether it will open. Now you can see the Mizamo motion just now already retargeted at here. And this can become your game model. You can import it to Unreal Engine or Unity, all of these game engines or any of any other 3D modeling and 3D animation software. Then you can render it properly and of course you can direct render it in Blender that should be no problem because the Blender itself is a very awesome rendering engine Alright, that's all for today about my sharing on how to retarget the Mizamo motions on any 3D avatar in Blender 3.6 just by using the Rococo plugin add-ons and that's all for today, thank you for watching if you love my videos, tutorials and sharing if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new videos, tutorials, or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing. See you!